everyone and welcome back to our channel it's your girl amaka glorious if you're seeing this channel for the first time you're welcome to be part of us just press subscribe and bell button so that you get notification anytime we upload videos and for all the non subscribers we love you ladies and gentlemen let me leave you to listen to this powerful woman of god as she talk about lies gossip beware of friends let me leave you to listen to her this is a powerful message to everyone you have to be careful beware of your friends beware who you call your friends beware where you place each and every friend you have they are office friends they are home friends that uh, she explained it very well let me leave you to listen to that how are you god bless you i'm here to do one assignment and that is to chase fake friends away from your lives fake friends i didn't say enemies one fake friend is more dangerous than five enemies these people are already enemies and they know they are enemies and you know that they are they've shown you they are enemies they don't like your progress that's why they are enemies they are looking for what to bring you down that's why they are enemies they don't think about your future whatsoever that will add to your destiny they are ready to puncture it that's why they are enemies when you need to be applauded they rather shy away that's why they are enemies and they've made you know so you know so you avoid them because you already know them but a fake friend that one that is very close to you you know the amazing thing they initiate the talk they want you to talk to them and confide in them and they begin and they want to seek your opinion one word you say will either give you a gossip or it will call you a murderer or a betrayal so i have one assignment and that is to chase fake friends away from your environment and my prayer today, as you say, amen, is that these people are very close to you. But from today, they will begin to see the light of God shining upon your life. That when they see you, they don't want to come close anymore. They are very dangerous. No enemy can get you without a fake friend. The enemies outside can't penetrate into your house without a fake friend. That's why the Bible says we should test all spirits. Leave the friend at the outer court. Let him remain there. Leave the one in the inner court. Let him stay there. Leave the holy of holies. Let him be where he should be. She is your friend in the office. Let her remain in the office. She is your bosom friend. Let her remain bosom. Let attitude and relationship bring people close to you. And not the container. Because she goes to the US and she comes back. Because he wears designers. Because she's highly placed. Because he rides the best of cars. You don't choose friends that way. Let me tell all the ladies. You don't, no matter how much a man tells you he loves you. Men love content. Men love vision. Men love brand. Men love intelligence. Men love wisdom. You could flaunt the breast. You could flaunt your body. You could flaunt the legs. They are very good though. God decorated you and gave you those. But you know what? Every man wants to relate with content. Every man and every woman wants to identify with success. Every fake friend. They are not there but all of a sudden your name is everywhere so they want to start coming they are not real they come close and they keep asking you money money i don't like beggars don't beg i don't like it when people come beggarly as if you're owing them made any fake friend that is around you f f that's what i call them fake friends they are not real they are laughter they are smile not deeply rooted they are laughing with you, smiling with you, but at, right in their heart, they are killing you. What can I do to bring him down? Let me tarnish his image. I decree and I declare 
that every fake friend around you will catch fire. They will not come close to you anymore. Let the fire of God that you carry on your forehead begin to chase them away because they are the ones you should be afraid of, not the ones that already made themselves enemies. Those ones you know. Like if you don't know who your enemies are, you're a baby. We all should know those who don't like us. We all should know those who are looking for a downfall, even those who talk evil against us. And yet, they rephrase it and they say you're the one talking evil against them. Those ones have made themselves enemies. So leave them where they are. Don't bring them into the inner court. You're going to spoil issues. You're going to spoil the case. You'll spoil the matter. Leave them there. School friend, school friend. Office friend, office friend. Let attitude, character, and relationship bring people close to you. May every fake friend in your office, in your kitchen, in your parlor, in your school, where you do your business, laughing with you, traveling all around with you. It could be a driver, but it's fake. It could be an orderly, but it's fake. It could be a get man, and it's fake. It could be your cook, and it's fake. It could be the one washing your shoes, your cars, everything washable, and it's fake. I don't know why this thing came up to my mind, but I charge the land, and I speak to the land, not to accommodate them anymore around you. In the name of Jesus Christ, enough of fake friends. They will see you. Once you begin to see them run away, and you've watched this video, give God all the glory. Because they don't mean well for you. They are looking for a way to come closer and kill and destroy you and sell you to the Philistines so that they will kill you. They will never see you again. Fire. They will never see you again. In the name of God the Father. They will never see you again. In the name of God the Son. They will never see you again. In the name of God the Holy Ghost. No more fake friends around you. But you. Be careful in Jesus' name.